Okay, I've got a brand new boiler here running. It's been about a half an hour since I fired it up. And it's already up to 80 or 90 pounds. It steams up real fast. It's got a big firebox on it. Antique whistle on it. Pop-off valve set at 100 pounds. Injector. Beautiful blowdown valves over here. Really nice mach machine bronze. Uh, water sight glass. We're up to 90 pounds now. It might pop off in a minute, so you might hear a loud noise, a lot of steam. Whistle works good. I'll blow it here. Sounds good. Big firebox. A lot of large wood in there. Let's get that. Steams up real fast. And uh, I want to test the injector here. Got it all plumbed in and just a kind of a temporary uh, water tank just to see if it is uh, actually drawing water. So I'm going to just try it right now and see if we can get it to work. Yeah. It's going down fast. A little bit of water coming out of the injector, but it's going down. Definitely uh, emptying the bucket. And a uh, drain valve over here. Yeah. Big. The boiler is uh, 18 inch diameter, uh, 40 inches tall, just the boiler. It's got a base on it that's about 26 inches square. Real solid quarter inch plate. Stack is a custom built cone, which is really hard to make. And a six inch stack. And if you notice the water sight glass is filled up a little bit just from that little bit of water we put in it. There's no water leg on this boiler, it doesn't need it. It's got 52 uh, 7 8 copper tubes in it. So it steams up really fast and doesn't really need a water leg. That's the way I can keep the cost down and very difficult to build them with a with a um, water leg. Well, that's about it. Got a little leak on the steam whistle there, but I can put some sealer on that and fix that on the threads. Very nice. That's about it.